I always fascinated about agoris, siddhi purush and spiritual people. I came to know that there are many siddhi purush lives in a caves in a place called Siddhara Betta. The literal translation to English is the hill of siddhi purush. The moment I reached the spot I was able to feel some positive energy. This is the hill where Siddhi Purush stay and some of the Siddhi Purush are meditating from 30, 40, 50 years. I am searching for them. There are many caves. I need to identify the caves. I have to ask the people. There is one good Shiva's temple also. There also you will see there is some speciality. Here in the local they believe it. This is the Sanjivini Betta because why this Siddhi Purushas come here? Siddhi Purusha, because this is called as Sanjivini Parvata. Ah. All type of medicines are available here. I started to inquire about the Siddhi Purush and met some fake people. Just by their vibe, I came to know they are not the people I want to meet. After searching many caves, then I reached the temple. The speciality of this temple is there is a small pond which is on the top of the hill and the speciality is the more you remove the water from this small pond the more water generates. On some occasions there are 6000 to 7000 people take bath from this water and even locals believe if we get the bath in this cold water of a small pond then we will not get any disease because it's the water from the Sanjeevini Betta. I started again to search for Siddhi Purush. There was no sign of Siddhi Purush. Hmm? They really stayed here. They stayed here. Bro, bucket, place to cook, place to sleep, and you can see this one also. This was the entrance to the cave. Even I discussed with the local people and one guy gave me a hint. Now I showed you the place where he meditated, where he used to live. He is meditating from 40 to 45 years here. So I got some hint where he will stay. We'll go there now and we'll see and try to get some information about meditation. Let's go. This is ashram where he stays now. At the end, I met the Siddhi Purush who stayed in Himalaya for 40 years and then he stayed in this Siddhara Betta for 4 years alone in a cave. After discussion about the meditation, spirituality, life, how he lived in Himalayas, everything, at the end he said only one simple thing which I think will help you out. <laughs>